They were almost shivering because they were so excited. My favorite part, Doug grabs his favorite donut toy and brings it over to her. Oh, Doug, did you bring her a toy? Are you giving her a bath one? Oh my goodness. You're gonna have to give her a bath after this one, Winston. Oh my gosh. What are they doing to your feet? Winston and Doug were definitely obsessed with her. Winston and Doug always wanted to be near her. You watching over her? Somehow they knew they needed to be gentle. I was worried about them wanting to grab her toys and chew them all up, and I literally have never had an issue. Maybe she got your ball. Did you bring her a toy? She's coming on you. They follow Miller everywhere. This is a doggy. It's so sweet to see Miller now react to the boys. She absolutely loves them. Did he get you? She's saying her first word and it's dog. dog I can't even make that's it up. Right. Is that the dog? Her second reaction when she sees them is to immediately start clapping. Do you see the doggies? Her third reaction is to start breathing really fast and start crawling towards them. Yay. She always wants to get closer to them. He's trying to get Winston. Let's go get her. Good morning. They always go in to help me wake her up. Look who came to see you. Oh, the doggies want to see you. It's just really sweet to watch them bond. <laughs> I'm so excited to watch them grow up together. Good boy. Are you playing with the doggy? Until this moment, our dog Vito was the only child, and he definitely acted like one. Vito, you want ice cream? Vito is our six-year-old boxer. He was wild. What? So I would consider him a troublemaker, for sure. He's very spoiled. Vito definitely knew that we were pregnant and he would always lay his head on my stomach. We were definitely curious on how he would act when the baby did come. Our son was born. We finally brought Luca home. We introduced them. He was definitely curious and wondering who this little tiny human was and if he was planning to stay. Vito, good boy. He definitely had to learn his big brother role. Vito, good boy. He couldn't be a chaotic tornado in our house. He had to really mellow down to keep the baby safe. Vito, who's there? He was glued to him. Are you laying with your brother? He took his role as a brother very seriously. 
Are you waiting for your brother? Should we wake him up? Vito started this new thing where he would start to bring toys to Luca as before when he was a puppy he would never play with toys. <laughs> One day we were just sitting in the family room and the most amazing thing happened. We look over and Luca is taking his first steps towards Vito. Not to mom and dad, but to his dog. They play tag. Luca likes to run around the house and laugh and Vito is right on his tail. Luca, that's your food. It's just so amazing watching them bond and grow together. They really are partners in crime, and Vito has truly been a blessing in our family and helping raise Luca. If my husband and I sat down in a chair, he just knew that she needed the blanket. Whiskey really liked to bring items to help me and Allie. He felt this immense love for her right at first sight. He wake me up first thing in the morning because he wanted to be next to the crib. I do really feel like in his heart he thinks it's his baby. He would go and lay next to her and put his head down and he licks her toes. He licks her hand. He had this calming effect. And this is his way of showing that he cares for her as though it's his baby. He really just had this protective instinct where he wanted to be a gentle, caring, loving dad. As Allie got older and started to learn to crawl and walk, Allie started to care for Whiskey. Whiskey loves food, and so one of the first skills that Allie learned was how to drop food from the high chair. Any kinds of fruits on her plate that she didn't want to eat, she would drop to him, and so it was a convenient excuse. She couldn't quite walk yet, but we would push her in a little blue car, and she would hold onto the leash learn to throw a ball. Now their bond evolved into this sweet caretaking relationship. She walks whiskey all around the neighborhood. At first, whiskey was the one caring for Allie. He'd be the first to greet Allie in the morning. Now you can really see how their relationship has evolved where Allie really wants to care for Whiskey. Allie has learned this deep love from Whiskey. To see this really happy, pure form of love really brightens my day. I know with great certainty Allie will grow up to be a kind, loving, affectionate, helpful, caring person. And we owe that to Whiskey.